Hi, I'm Doug Redford from Doug Reds Tackle World, and we get asked a lot how to crimp up a uh, crimp onto a leader correctly. So today we're going to teach you how to do that, applying the crimp to the leader with a pair of crimping pliers, which you can use for rigging up any live baits or skirter lures, a lot of uh, different types of things you could use it on. Okay, let's run through the gear we're going to use to do the crimp up. So we've got our leader, 120 pound leader, one millimetre diameter, and we've got some one millimetre size crimps which will fit in there. But to do this first, uh, we need to actually just cut a little bit off the end of the leader, which we'll show you in a moment. So we cut the end of the leader on a 45 degree angle, which will go through the crimp much easier. Then we're going to use our crimping pliers. So our crimping pliers, we use a pair of pliers that have the holes in it and not the teeth. It's really important you get the right set of, pl set of pliers there. So each hole designates a different size crimp that it will do. So those little crimp pliers there will do from around about 100 pounds up to around about three or 400 pounds maybe. Okay, next we're going to do is grab our crimp and we're going to put the crimp onto the leader. Then we're going to grab whatever we want to use, whether it be a hook or a swivel. In this case, a hook, we we'll thread it through. It's a circle hook. That's a, that's a serine hook. We're going to go back through the crimp. Now we're going to pull it down to the length that we're happy with above the hooks, which we'll do now. Rightio, so now we're going to do the crimp. So to do the crimping part, we must turn the crimp over so it's on, a, a, on the long side. So you have a flat, narrow side and a long, deep side. So the deep side we're crimping down on. And we're starting in from the edge. We don't want to crimp on the edge because we'll actually cut into our line. So we have a little flange, that little flange will protect that edge of the uh, crimp cutting into the line. And we'll just move the crimp up a bit and we'll do the same again on the other end. Now you can check this at home once you've done it. You can put a nail onto a piece of board that's, that's uh, tied up to something and pull on it. But always be careful that no hooks pull out and get you <laughs> or uh, a swivel breaks or anything like that because it is quite a strong application that you're doing here, then that's how it looks at the end of the day. So perfectly crimped and uh, ready to go.